Good afternoon, parents. Let's begin with a quick prayer together, reflecting on John chapter 16, verse 33. Let us hear Jesus' voice speaking to us across time, speaking to our hearts in the year 2020. I have told you this so that you might have peace in me. In the world you will have trouble, but take courage. I have conquered the world. I have told you this so that you might have peace in me. In the world you will have trouble, but take courage. I have conquered the world. Amen. It has been a busy day here at Blessed Sacrament. This morning, our superintendent, Janet Eden, came to preview our re-entry plan. And this evening, our school council met to offer their feedback. We are still on track to release this plan to you parents this Wednesday. There are two guiding principles that your new principal has leaned on when making decisions this last month. The first guiding principle for our school is grace and flexibility. This is what will carry us through this ever-changing year. This is what we offered to you parents last spring with continuous learning and what we will offer you this fall, knowing that every family is going through different circumstances. This is what we hope you will extend to us, knowing that this is new territory for us as well. Grace and flexibility. The second guiding principle is risks versus benefits. Every decision we make weighs the possible risks versus the benefits, whether that's driving a car, going for a swim, or eating a whole pint of ice cream. When we look at our school, we know there are so many benefits for our students being on site this fall. Academic benefits as they receive rigorous instruction directly from their teachers, social and emotional benefits as they get to be around their friends, spiritual benefits. Who can calculate the benefits of the graces received by attending mass together or praying every day? Looking at the science, I believe Blessed Sacrament will be a safe place for our students and faculty this fall. For the elderly and the immunocompromised, COVID-19 needs to be taken seriously. We all must do our part to protect one another. Scientific data, though, has shown that the risk for healthy children is very, very small. And studies out of Denmark, Australia, and Ireland have shown that re reopening schools in those countries did not lead to a rise in infections among adults. Children are not driving the spread of this virus. Looking at this data, I believe the benefits of being at Blessed Sacrament this fall far outweigh the marginal risks. But I am also aware that that is not the case for all our families. You are the primary educators of your child. You know your family better than I do. And you may discern that even with all these wonderful benefits for your family, the risks are still too great. Today, ahead of the release of our plan, I wanted to speak directly to those families so that you will hear my voice and know what a hard decision this has been. While I wish we could provide an online option for every family that does not feel comfortable returning to school, we simply do not have the resources to do this. Our school will offer remote learning only to a handful of students with medical documentation through their individual health plans 
also known as IHPs. For the rest of our students, we must focus on the great task before us of giving quality in-person instruction while adapting to all the new changes we'll be adding to our building to keep our students safe. For any other families that choose to homeschool, if you have already paid your enrollment fees, workbooks have already been ordered for your child and they have already been enrolled with online subscriptions for Accelerated Reader and Alex Math. We will loan you our textbooks so that choosing a curriculum will be one less thing you have to worry about. Our teachers will post their weekly lesson plans so that you can help your child stay on track with their peers in hopes that they will be able to rejoin them at semester or for the 21-22 school year. But you, their caregiver, will be responsible for the instruction and grading. We are so blessed in our parish to already have a thriving homeschooling group. I met with them this last week, and they are ready and willing to walk you through the process of registering your home as a private school and answering any questions you have. Andover eAcademy is another option that is available to you. On Wednesday, you can look over our plan and read about all the mitigation strategies we are taking to decrease risks even further. And then you will make a decision for your family. I am praying for you as you make this decision. And I want you to know that whatever you decide, you are not alone, that you are supported you are still a part of our Blessed Sacrament family. I am praying that in this challenging decision, you will feel the peace that we can only find in Christ. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this.